Uh, also on the darkness episode where we talk about horrible things. Remember climate night? So last week, all of the comedians got together to do PR for the DNC. And it was all about climate change. COVID is losing its effectiveness. People are waking up. Even New Yorkers are storming the Bastilles and saying we've had enough, which looks weird in New York, I got to say, because it is so communist. These dummies elected a socialist mayor twice, the most incompetent mayor we've ever had, who knowingly, brazenly, and proudly has destroyed New York City permanently, along with his enemy Cuomo, Andrew Cuomo. They keep voting for him, so it's shocking to see them wake up. So if New Yorkers are finally waking up, then it's time to abandon that. So now they're getting big on climate change. CNN made that clear. They said, we're going to stop focusing on uh, COVID and and Trump, obviously, because he's gone. So we're going to focus on climate change. And I thought, well, that's annoying, right? And then we discover, thanks to my new favorite Twitter account, one, two, Um, Amy Therese. I just heard of her now. I saw her because I was looking at Danny Hellman, a fantastic cartoonist, and he had just done a picture of her. I knew him 20 years ago, and I emailed him and said, hey, I didn't know you were red-pilled. And uh, he didn't respond. (laughs) So not all red pills like the G-Dog. Anyway, we can proudly say that on the Darkness episode. I don't have to be positive for once. I'm sure it's just a coincidence that all the late night comedy shows converged on climate change propaganda the same week as the Dems are fighting to push a $3.5 trillion Green New Deal budget through Congress. $3.5 trillion. Here's something you should try, Ryan, with your tiny Bronx brain. Type out in the, the URL... What is 3.5 trillion divided by 331 million? Nope. Did you add a question mark? And why didn't you write, why did you write trillion but not million? So write million. Instead of those fucking zeros. Just do something consistent, please, once in your life. Trillion divided by million calculator? Okay, let's try that one. So it's, what was it? I already forgot. 3.5 trillion divided by 350 million? Sure, whatever. Hello? Hello? There we go. Okay, blow that up. I can't read it. $10,574. So everyone in America for the Green New Deal has to shell out ten grand. Have you got ten grand floating around? It's an okay used car. Do you, have you got an extra used car? What are all those homeless people in San Francisco who take shits in the street? What about all the crackheads in Philadelphia? What about the junkies that are dying to the tune of, I think, 120 a day? Have they got 10 grand floating around? No. Very few people post-pandemic, post-bankruptcy, have 10 grand floating around. Yet the DNC has decided that it's going to use their army of late-night comedy hosts to make you shell out 10 grand to what? Have a building grow moss on the side? All this bullshit about fucking... Green buildings is so European. These stupid buildings you see in Norway where the top of it is a ski hill and the side of it is a solar farm and the the walls all grow grass sideways. Fuck off. They're all totally inefficient. They all burn more energy to create than they can ever provide, just like windmills. The amount of shit, the amount of carbon and gas and coal you need to make one windmill makes it Totally impossible for that windmill to pay for itself. That's an irrelevant link, Ryan. What's that got to do with anything? More hosts. More tweets. Oh, I see. More hosts. Yeah. Um, 